Good evening. Perth identity John Kizon is fighting for his life in hospital after suffering a heart attack behind the wheel. The controversial businessman was trying to make it to hospital when he crashed his car outside Sir Charles Gardner, leaving a trail of damage. The end of a dangerous ride that's left controversial identity John Kizon in a critical condition. The 56-year-old was trying to drive himself to Sir Charles Gardner Hospital but didn't make it inside, his heart stopping, causing him to lose control. First, ramming his BMW into a parked patient transfer vehicle, then into a bus shelter before zigzagging down the road, colliding with traffic posts, bollards and finally a tree. Hospital staff ran out to help and performed CPR. When police arrived, they spent four hours searching his car and gathering evidence. John Kizon is no stranger to the limelight or the police. In 1982, as a 19-year-old, he was convicted of selling heroin. But since then, he's faced and beaten a series of charges, including money laundering, insider trading and assault. The businessman's friendships have also raised eyebrows over the years. He has a close relationship with Melbourne gangland survivor Mick Gatto and was a pallbearer at the funeral for Victorian crime boss Alphonse Gangitano. He also had a close relationship with Ben Cousins. These days, he has business interests in Bali and Perth's nightclub scene. The last time we saw Mr Kizon was in a bizarre appearance in a video posted to social media from Singapore in June. John Kizon, K-I-Z-O-N, from Perth, Australia. I love Trump. Big, big supporter of Trump. Uh, drain the swamp, like they say. We love him in Australia. He's a, he's a little bit controversial, but I think he has to do that to clean the swamp up. It's not clear why he was back home before the crash. I'm surprised. Uh, I'm pleased uh, no one else has been hurt. Uh, and I uh, understand the police will un undertake a full investigation. Uh, and obviously, uh, I hope he recovers. And Grace Fitzgibbon is at Sir Charles Gardner Hospital. Grace, what's John Kizon's condition tonight? Well, Tracy, the 56-year-old remains in hospital. He's in a critical but stable condition. His family and friends have been by his bedside as doctors work to determine what may have caused this medical episode. Meanwhile, that police investigation is still ongoing. They're trying to piece together the final moments that led up to the crash, including how long Mr Kizon had been behind the wheel before he made it here to the hospital. Trace? Grace, thanks for the update.